Welcome to our YouTube channel. Today, we're going to share with you the recipe for fish biryani, a beloved dish that combines the aromatic flavors of biryani spices with tender fish and fragrant basmati rice. Biryani is a popular Indian and Pakistani rice dish known for its rich flavors and distinctive layers. Join us as we take you through the step-by-step -step process of making this delicious and indulgent fish biryani. To make fish biryani, you will need the following ingredients. 500 grams fish fillets, such as boneless cod, snapper, or tilapia, cut into pieces. 2 cups basmati rice. 1 large onion, thinly sliced. 2 tomatoes, chopped. 2 green chilies, slit lengthwise. 1 half cup plain yogurt. 2 tablespoons ginger garlic paste. 1 teaspoon turmeric powder. 1 teaspoon red chili powder. 1 teaspoon biryani masala powder. 1 teaspoon garam masala powder. 1 half teaspoon cumin seeds. 4 cloves. 4 green cardamom pods. 1 inch cinnamon stick. A pinch of saffron strands. Optional. Fresh cilantro leaves. For garnish. Fresh mint leaves. For garnish. The or cooking oil. Salt to taste. Water for cooking rice and marinade. Let's start cooking. Marinating the fish. In a bowl, combine the fish pieces with 1 tablespoon ginger garlic paste, turmeric powder, red chili powder, and salt. Mix well, ensuring that the fish is evenly coated with the marinade. Cover the bowl and let the fish marinate in the refrigerator for at least 30 minutes. Cooking the rice. Rinse the basmati rice under cold water until the water runs clear. In a large pot, Bring water to a boil and add the rinsed rice along with a pinch of salt. Cook the rice until it is 70 to 80% done, as it will continue to cook further during the assembling process. Drain the partially cooked rice and set it aside. Saute the spices and onions. In a separate deep bottomed pan or Dutch oven, heat ghee or cooking oil over medium heat. Add the cumin seeds, cloves, green cardamom pods, and cinnamon stick. Sauté the spices for a minute until they release their aroma. Add the sliced onions and sauté until they turn golden brown. Layering the biryani. Reduce the heat to low and spread half of the partially cooked rice evenly over the sautéed onions. Sprinkle half of the biryani masala powder and garam masala powder over the rice. Layer half of the marinated fish pieces, chopped tomatoes, and slick green chilies on top. Repeat the layering process with the remaining rice, spices, fish, tomatoes, and green chilies. If using saffron, dissolve the saffron strands in a tablespoon of warm milk and drizzle it over the top layer. Dumb cooking. Cover the pan with a tight-fitting lid or aluminum foil to create a sealed environment for cooking. Cook the fish biryani on low heat for about 20 to 25 minutes, allowing the flavors to melt together and the fish to cook through. Serving. Once the biryani is cooked, gently fluff the rice and fish layers with a fork, being careful not to break the fish pieces. Garnish with fresh cilantro leaves and mint leaves. Serve the fish biryani hot, accompanied by raita, yogurt dip, or your favorite side dishes. There you have it, a fragrant and flavorful fish biryani that tantalizes your taste buds with its aromatic spices and tender fish. This layered rice dish is perfect for special occasions or when you want to indulge in a hearty and satisfying meal. We hope you enjoyed this recipe. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to our channel for more exciting recipes. Happy cooking and savor the deliciousness of your homemade fish biryani.